What up, boys and girls? It's your boy Corey B out here in the Mm. Alright, so we're talking about some Holy Stone drones. Alright, let me reach down and grab this one. Alright, this is my HS 110D. Probably one of my favorite drones just because of the lighting. It's got these lights. You got uh, blue lights in the back, white lights in the front. Um, However, let me say something about this drone. Okay, this is my second one. I lost one of them. Can't find it. <laughs> Nowhere. Um, however, the second one, I obviously now know, yeah, let's try not to fly this 200 feet in the air. Um, but if you can see this camera transmitter right here, I haven't been able to take a single, pic single picture in this thing through the app, through an SD card, whatever. So it's, uh, yeah. All right. Now, let's get to the reason of the call. All right. Now, this is the Holy Stone HS510. Okay. Good looking drone. Out of the bag. Mark, pull that shit out. Okay, all these videos and shit that show you everything that goes with the drone. Man, really, do you really want to see what the screwdriver looks like? Okay, look. Boom. Okay, batteries. More foam. Alright, this is a big thing to me. Alright, this controller. Make sure you pay attention. One side has the wire, that's the receiver. This one, yeah, it doesn't do shit. It doesn't even sit straight. See how they're crooked? like that it's straight but they're backwards okay anyways this is my main complaint here you see how small this damn controller is now this is a controller tons of space feels good the response okay oh we're gonna get rid of that all right so this is the new one. This is the 510. Okay. Now, the reason I lost this drone, and they sent me a new one, thank you, Holy Stone, is because, do you see that coloring? Okay. Flying in a blue sky, if that thing is not synced right, your line of sight is totally gone. However, it is heavier, it's nice. You turn Alexa down. Alexa, turn down. Alexa, turn down. Okay, so we're gonna get in this box here. Grab a battery. Okay, you know, all the normal stuff, blades, cords. Oh, battery. It is good that it comes with two batteries. And unlike the HS 110D, yeah, you gotta plug the drone in by itself. This actually comes with a battery charger. So that's kind of cool. Alright, so let's put this bad boy in. Oh, and the H10 HS 10D. Yeah, that trim feature, what a nightmare. All right, so this is it. Pure gray, skies are blue. Once it gets about 50 feet up in the air, you can't see anything. But it does have the GPS. Oh, look, my daughter decided, daughter decided to show up. All right, 
it does have the GPS, the follow me, all that stuff. Now, the one complaint I do have about this, okay, and I don't have a lot about it because it's actually a pretty, pretty good drone, is besides not being able to see it, the only light you have is right here. That's it. So when you have to do the GPS coordination and do the twisting and the, and the circling, if you're outside in the daylight, you can't see it. You have no idea. However, for the price, it's a great little drone. It's really good. It's heavy duty. Um, the camera is tiltable. Even a nine year can do it. And there's there's your light. So okay. You see how bright that is? We're inside with lighting. Now if you're supposed to do this in the daylight. Yeah, that's that's my biggest complaint right there. Cause how in the hell, first off, do you see it in the in the air? And then how do you set it up? Anyways, so this is my little review. I'm going to go charge this up a little bit. I'm going to go fly this since it's not windy outside, even though it's actually pretty heavy. Um, and uh, maybe we'll get some video for you. Other than that, hey, this is your boy Corey B from the AV. My daughter Georgia Rose. We all love her. And I'll see you on the flip side.